The Polish armed forces began to be equipped with Bayraktar TB2 drones made by Baker Technologies, Turkey. The first batch of Bayraktar TB2 was handed over by the Minister of Defense and Deputy Prime Minister of Poland Marius Blaszczak to the country's 12th unmanned aerial vehicle base. Blaszczak said drones have become a necessity for modern armed forces. There is no modern army without modern drones, he said. The Polish Ministry of Defense reported that the first shipment of Bayraktar TB2 had arrived in Poland this week. Previously, Bayraktar TB2 operator and technician training was completed in Turkey. In the future, Poland will still buy drones for its armed forces. This is in line with the modernization of the country's weapon system. The Bayraktar TB2 is a medium-altitude long-endurance unmanned combat aerial vehicle capable of remotely controlled or autonomous flight operations. It is manufactured by the Turkish company Baker Makina Sanayi Ve Tikaret AS, primarily for the Turkish armed forces. The aircraft are monitored and controlled by an aircrew in a ground control station, including weapons employment. The development of the UAV has been largely credited to Selçuk Bayraktar, a former MIT graduate student. The TB2 drone had completed 400,000 flight hours globally by November 2021. The largest operator of TB2 drones is the Turkish military, but an export model has been sold to the militaries of a number of other countries. The Bayraktar TB2 platform has a blended wing body design with an inverted V tail structure. Thrust is generated by a variable pitch two blade propeller in pusher configuration. The propeller is mounted between the tail booms and driven by an internal combustion engine located in the body. The monocoque platform is modular with detachable main items such as wing, tail boom, and V-tails. Fuselage pieces are made mostly of carbon fiber composite with machined aluminum parts at joints. Fuel is stored within bladder tanks and fuel consumption is balanced with solenoid valves. 24 drones were ordered in 2021 making Poland the first NATO and EU country to buy the drones. Poland this year bought a variety of weapon systems in large numbers.